Abuja. To other news, 20 secondary school students have died as a result of the outbreak of meningitis in Potiscom, Fika and Fune towns of Yobe State. The state government has now deployed health workers to the affected areas to halt the spread of the viral outbreak to other nearby communities. TVC News correspondent Michael Ashoma visited some of the affected schools in Potiscom. Break of meningitis in Potisco, Fika, and Fune local government areas has left 20 persons dead, while more than 100 students are receiving medical treatment. They have been quarantined within the school premises. The emergency of the situation made the Ministry of Education to relocate to affected schools. TV News crew visited some of the schools in Potisco where the infected students are being attended to by medical workers. Roughly about 214 students came into the uh, facility of which have they been seen and um, as I'm talking to you we only have about um, eight students left in the facility. The state government has swung into action to avert more deaths and spread of the disease. Of receiving the information of uh, this outbreak the ministry in collaboration with uh, that of minister, that's the Minister of Health we had a meeting with SSG in order to map his strategies on how best to tackle this, to tackle this, the spread of this menace. The Minister of Education was deployed to this very school to see that this problem is over with all form of uh, effort, either advisably or uh, medically and otherwise. This school also had its fair share of the outbreak as about seven students were confirmed to have lost their lives to the disease. This isolation center is open here purposely to curb the menace of this uh, uh, disease. And uh, we admitted about 112 students here. Uh, we have the health personnel from the hospital and the primary health care units. Currently, we have 43 on the ground and 69 were discharged. Some people who have declined to speak on camera attributed the unfortunate incident to lack of proper hygiene, conjection of students in a confined dormitories, and consumption of contaminated food, among others. Potiscom residents appeal to the state government to investigate the cause thoroughly and sanction those responsible for the unfortunate incident. Michael Ushoma. TVC News, Potisco. For more on the outbreak, TVC News correspondent Michael Ashoma joins me on the news. Michael, thank you for joining us. What more do we know about this viral outbreak, the reactions of residents and efforts to tackle it? Well, the, according to the Commissioner for Health, he told us that, um, he told journalists that the governor has given a marching order and there is an emergency presently in all the affected schools and health workers have been deployed to the affected schools to take preventive measures and ensure that um, the students are well taken care of in terms of treatment and also preventive measures. As we speak at the moment, the, there is an emergency in, in, in Portiscom and other affected local governments. And, um, they are ensuring that the, 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 the disease do not spread to other neighboring communities and villages that is surrounding some of the affected local governments at the moment. Well, Michael Oshoma for us there in your state. Thank you very much for that update and please stay safe.